Hello guys, welcome back to another video of Sick Mario Bros. And today, I'll be showing you my Bowser figure collection. This is day two celebration of Bowser Day. I mean, Bowser Week. Bowser Day is August 4th, and yeah, so this is day two celebration. And I decided to do a whole week celebration of Bowser Day because I wanted to and post out a video every day. So yeah, that is what we are doing today. And I will be showing off my figure collection, like I already said. So yeah, let's get into it. Oh, and before we start, sorry, my voice will probably be echoing throughout this video. Because I am in a room where there's like lots of echoes. So just mind the echo. Okay, so first, let's start with McDonald's figures. We're not going to start with the McDonald's Mario movie Bowsers. Well, Bowser, I have two of them, but let's just do the normal Bowser, so... Here he is, right here, and as you guys have probably noticed, I am doing this on like a lava background that I got from like a Jack specific diorama set and stuff like that. So that's the background I'm using. So yeah, this Bowser's overall really nice. I lost the fire theme that goes into him. Then next, there's this Bowser, another one of him, then another one. And a fourth and final one. So yeah, there are four of the McDonald's Bowsers. I got them when I was young, when I used to damage my stuff. So that is why a lot of them are scratched up. Because I used to damage my figures. And then next are the Mario Movie McDonald's figures. These ones, I still have the fire, but it does not shoot fire. It spins it around. I feel like that's more lame, but... It's fine, I guess. And I have two of him. Let's move these guys to the back so you guys can see the smaller ones. Okay, so I just moved them to the back. Now we're going to get to the Hot Wheels. Okay, so I only have Hot Wheels Dry Bowsers, which is kind of weird. I don't have a Bowser Hot Wheel, but here we go. I have two of them. So I love Dry Bowser so much. He's my favorite Mario character. Other than Gold Dry Bowser. Please, Jack Specific, make a Dry Bowser figure and a Gold Dry Bowser figure. I just want Gold Dry Bowser merchandise because we have, like, none. But, anyways, these are really cool. And they roll because, obviously, they're Hot Wheels. Just, like, they each have their own mechanic. These roll... These ones used to shoot fire out of their mouth, but I lost all of them. And then this guy spins fire, same with this guy. And yeah, now let's get to the Jack Specific Bowsers. Okay, so I only have one 2.5 inch Bowser. It's the one that I got in the um in like a playset. It's like the like the one where it drops the bridge. I forgot what playset it's called. It'll probably come to me later, but yeah, so this guy. He doesn't really have a feature, but he does have articulation. He has moving arms, a turning head, and the legs don't move, but his tail does move. So one, two, three, four. I'd like it if they made an updated articulated Bowser figure. That would be really nice for the 2.5 inch. They need a 4 inch Bowser to scale well, because they have the 6 inch one, which I have. But that one's too big for, like, the 2.5-inch figures. And then the 2.5-inch Bowser's too small. So a 4-inch Bowser, I feel like, would work very well for both. Like, maybe, like, in between. Like, maybe, like, a 5-inch Bowser. Because so far they made a 2.5-inch, a 7-inch, and a 6-inch. Which, the 6 and 7 inches are too big. And a 5-inch would be perfect for 2.5-inch and 4-inch, I feel like. So, I, so, Jack, please make a 5-inch Bowser. But anyways, let's get to the 6-inch Bowser. Oh, and of course, the name for the playset just came to me just barely. So it's the Deluxe Bowser Battle Playset. Okay, so here this guy is. I don't know if you guys can see him. No, let's. I'm going to have to move these guys over here. And these guys are going to have to go right there. So he will fit in. 
Okay, so I just adjusted the camera so we can fit all these guys in. And yeah, so here's this guy is. He's massive. He has, I forgot how many points of articulation. He has a ball joint arm, so two bending elbows, so three, four, eight, five, six, wait, no, not five. So eight, nine, ten, eleven. I believe he has eleven points of articulation. I could be wrong, though. I'm, I'm not sure, but I believe he does have eleven points of articulation. And a really good Bowser, by the way. I really love this Bowser. It's like a really good one, just a tiny bit too big. So one inch smaller and it would be perfect. A five inch Bowser. It's definitely better than the 2.5 inch one. The 2.5 inch one is pathetic. It's, it's way too small. Okay, so I'm going to remove this guy. Because the seven inch Bowser I'm going to have to put in. I'm going to have to remove all these. Because he is massive. Okay, so this is my favorite Bowser that I'm about to show. This guy. This seven inch fire breathing Bowser. If you push on the spike, he shoots. It makes him look like he's breathing fire, right? Look at that. It's just missed, but it's so cool. Okay guys, so I'm currently in the darkest room in my house. It does echo again in this room. Let me try and get, and the reason I wanted to bring him into the darkest room, so I can show you this. I'm about to turn off the light, so it's gonna get dark. Okay. There he is in the dark. He looks a hundred times better, and it looks better in person. So if you have not gotten this figure yet, then please get it for your own sake. It is so much fun. All you need is to put water in it, in the back of the figure. You just need to put water in it, and then you need to turn up. You need to put batteries in. You take off the shell. Just watch. Just watch my review video. I think I covered it. Or just watch a review video. Just search up a review video for this figure. And yeah, it is really good. It is so entertaining. By far my favorite Bowser figure. It is 30 bucks, but you might be able to get it on sale on Amazon or something like that. And, yeah. Okay, I think that's enough. Okay, so that is going to wrap up my Bowser figure collection. So I hope you enjoyed this day two of Bowser week special. And, yeah, so please like and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Bye!